we're back, we're back at the marina and just a tip to realise that if you're staying anywhere near the Paradise Palace, that's where we're staying, um, that you can actually get to this marina by walking along the beach. We did it earlier this morning, it's just over half an hour, whereas you can get the taxi, but the taxis, they do take you a little bit away from this marina. And it's about eight dinar coming, which is only say a couple, couple of quid. Um, going back, it was a bit more because we started walking. But I think if you leave early in the morning, perhaps say eight o'clock, 8.30, you can walk along the beach, it's cool enough and you know we're heading back and it's i think it's about 10 30 so we're heading back before it gets overly hot but still along the beach and it's cool and you can walk in the sand but highly recommend so and then say so we've got this marina we've got one pirate boat in i mean two of the pirate boats have already gone out we're already at sea and they've got lots of places there's lots of places to buy tickets and we've just been told by a guy in a proper hut thing um, like concession stand etc that the prices in hotels for whether it's boats or any excursions are normally extortionately high and that they will charge you in pounds so he said for example they may charge you 30 pounds for the pirate ship he says they charge 30 dinars which is 10 pounds you know less so we are going to check it out in the hotel so I'll be back about that later just to see the price differential um, but he says don't buy from people who are walking on the street, just get from a proper concession uh, when you want to buy things to do with quad bikes or um, say the pirate ships or paragliding for people over the sea. But um, yeah, so there's still a bit more to tell you but we'll catch up later. So just to add, so where the pirate boats is, this is the bridge that once you come off the beach you can walk across and then it takes you and you can walk along there and you just go around the corner where that blue restaurant is in the distance, just zoom in there, go around the corner, you can get smoothies, other types of drink, and then you're on the kind of shopping area, so it's not too far at all. And as I pan round, you'll see this restaurant I'm referring to where we had a smoothie and I'd highly recommend it. And then if I zoom around, so we're now gonna go back to the beach just over there. So this is the beginning part of the marina, which is kind of in the central square of Yasmin Hammamet. This is the front area. We were early, so nothing much was open, but you've got restaurants, hotels, and a nice kind of supermarket department store there. So lovely walk you can have around here. This is definitely for boat enthusiasts. If you like your boats, Yasmin Hammamet Marina is the place for you. Here are the pirate ships that you can go on excursions on from Yasmin Hammamet to the old part of Hammamet. And we did find out later that it was more expensive to book these via the hotel. <laughs> 